Hey guys, we got a SND full list on the map grid. And I got two topics to talk about. One about the MP5K and another one about the Battlefield Bad Company 2. Battlefield Bad Company 3 game coming out. Yeah. Um, I'm, I've been using MP5K lately. And it's been working out. My favor. It's like a shotgun up close. And at range, it's beast. Because like, there's absolutely like no recoil. It seems like if you try and aim with the MP5K, it's like terrible. But if you don't, it's like basically a gun for like people who are new to the game. But if you have any bit of skill or anything like that, or accuracy or something, use that gun. It's just godly. Anyway, I want to kind of explain this game a little bit. This is um, a comp bare bones competition map or matchup. And I think that there was only two people on the other team. I don't know what happened to the rest of the people. I think they raged because we. This is the second time playing the match. Anyway, Battlefield Bad Company Two. Lately, been playing it, enjoying it, and um, yeah, it's a great game. I think it's way better than Call of Duty. To be honest with you, the only reason that keeps me from playing Battlefield Bad Company 2 is I'd say the years of experience from Call of Duty. I've been playing since it was Call of Duty 4. So, say, um, if I had the years of experience in, um, Battlefield, that game I would pick every time over Call of Duty. It's just amazing. It really is. Everything's equal there's quads to get you across the only thing that i would like better is for some smaller maps like the maps are like the size of like i don't even know how to describe it it's like the size of like a little small town or something a little bit bigger than a town they're just humongous it's yeah some like there are these like flag points or whatever. I don't even know. I'm a noob to the game. And I actually got one gameplay from Battlefield that's good. I guess is good. Don't really play it, so I wouldn't know what would be good and bad. Um. Anyway, I need like a quad to basically go to a flag in order to defend it. Like it's not like um. Any domination maps or capture flag maps, you know, to where it takes you about, like, maybe a minute to get the other side of the map. You know, like, 15 seconds to run a flag. If you were to flag one point to the other, depending on, like, bases, it might take you, I'd say, good maybe 5 to 10 minutes to run a flag. Battlefield and company. Not to mention all the gunfights that you have to get into and everything. It's not a fast paced game it's more of a slower type game kind of campy better for they made the maps like sniping maps they're basically a lot of sniping maps but all the snipers suck i don't i don't know where they went with that i guess they made it like that so that way not everyone would be running around with the sniper rifle is my guess because it takes two bullets to kill someone with the sniper but it's not like semi-automatic snipers either it's like you shoot your gun, then you have to like zoom out the scope, reload, zoom back in, shoot. That's terrible. Defend I don't snipe. I use an assault. I don't even know what gun I use. I got an optic scope on it though. That's all I know. But I got that op optic scope, the ammo, and the more damage, I guess, for the enemy, for an enemy to blow me up. They also have motion sensors in there. I wonder if anybody knows of a game mode where it's like Search and Destroy. Search and Destroy is by far the f funnest game mode I've ever played. Like, if everybody made like their game types, like Call of Duty, like had every Call of Duty game type plus their own, it would be an amazing game. But anyway, please, um, thumbs up, comment, subscribe.